Hallelujah, glory to God. You're welcome back to Prophetic Intercession with Amel. It's always a privilege and an honor to have you here on this channel. I do not take your presence here for granted. I am here because you are out there. It's always a thing of joy for me to be a channel through which God speaks to you, give you prophetic direction and counseling. I'm always happy to be in that position. God bless you. Thank you so much to everyone who sends me words of encouragement, who prays for me. Thank you so much. Your prayers keep me going. Thank you. A special thanks to people who are partnering with the ministry. Thank you so much. They keep me going. They make me know that you love me. You believe in me. Thank you so much. Hallelujah. God is about to give someone a divine consolation. God says he's about to give someone a divine consolation. How did I receive this word? God just took me to the story of Hannah and I saw it from another light and I knew it was a word for someone. You know, Hannah was believing God for a child and her, faith, her co-wife Penina had given birth to several children why she had not even had one child and after she prayed god heard her and answered her and gave her a son let me tell you what that son represents samuel was not just a son that was given to hannah it was a prophet the bible says among all the prophets in the in the bible there is no prophet like samuel his words never fell to the ground the words of samuel never fell to the ground after the prophet samuel came samuel was what more than all of the sons of penina Samuel was what more than all of them he was just one son but he was what more than all of them can you tell me the one of the name of the sons of penina you do not know them because they were not relevant they were not important but we are reading today about samuel he was one of the greatest prophets of god that lived god says he took me here to tell me that i should announce to someone he's about to give you a divine consolation he's about to give you a consolation i don't know where they laughed at you they really caught you they mocked you because of something you lacked or god had not given you yet god says about to give you one that is going to make their mouth shut he's going to give you one that will become a major testimony hallelujah glory to god i pray that as you listen to the sound of my voice these words act as light in your life and it makes this prophetic word to manifest as you're listening to me god will give you a divine consolation that will console you for your days of empty for your days of lack for your days where you were ridiculed and mocked at in the name of Jesus, God will give you a blessing that will make your mockers, that will silence your mockers. It will silence your mockers. It will silence your mockers. It will be an evidence that you are serving a living God. Receive that miracle and that testimony right now. In the mighty name of Jesus, amen. God bless you.